Too many men are aimlessly wondering about life today. There's no fight, there's no purpose, there's no passion, there's no unite, unite. unite. You have Start with liver, get some really good sleep, move like liver king, eat like liver king, shield like liver king. Live like the ancestral man and you'll have the hormone profile that's double or triple of the manicured modern man. That was what Liver King has been preaching on social media. But everything came crashing down on him when a screenshot of him demanding for steroids from his nutritionist and blood test result got leaked in a YouTube video that exposed what was really the secret behind the muscles, abs, and biceps. Before all this came out, he was asked about this in an interview, and the Liver King said, this actually became a thing you know, that people started asking if I had real abs, and then if I had ab implants done, and all this ridiculous stuff, you know, and think if somebody touches it right now, just feels like the thing, I mean, I'm flexing my abs right now, I mean, I have my shirt off, yeah, I'm flexing this whole time, I'm more comfortable now flexing my abs than not flexing my abs. It is actually not a surprise that Liver King with his bulging abs and biceps and a sports beard has been one of the most popular figures on social media in the past year. He quickly gained followers by asserting that eating an organ meat heavy diet is one of the secrets to strength, happiness, and good health. The father of two claims that his rigorous workouts and diet as a modern caveman are the keys to how he's attained and maintained his ripped body. Johnson had asserted several times that his body is entirely normal and often posted videos of himself chowing down on raw animal liver, protein drinks, egg yolk, and bone marrow. He had promoted a diet of raw flesh and strenuous exercise to gain strength, health, and happiness. Although liver will always be his first love, the liver king also praises the benefits of other sometimes disregarded animal parts like bone marrow, the tongue, and the balls. He believed that consuming the testicles of other animals could strengthen your own. According to him, vegetables don't have the raw material required to develop a good set of testicles. The ability to create, support, and strengthen testicles is present in animals' testicles. The Liver King has always had his critics. Nutritionists and fitness professionals have expressed concern over the man's decision to consume raw meat, which could potentially expose his body to pathogens. Uh, you know what? Half the animal's testicles that I've eaten, I don't even know what kind of animal they are. Others, I know you guys are going to think this might sound a certain way, right? But some are really delicious and creamy. It was not only Joe Rogan that thought that behind all the ancestral lifestyle that he might be juicing. He had brushed off the rumors and speculations about him using steroids several times and just expresses his happiness that notable people were talking about him as his fame increased and prominent figures in the sports and fitness industries, including podcaster Joe Rogan. He had firmly insisted, though, that performance-enhancing drugs had no influence on the growth of his physique, which he claimed to have been developing since he was a teenager. Johnson's use of steroids, which cost him $12,000 per month, was exposed in an hour-long video by another YouTuber named More Plates before he came clean. It contained Johnson's leaked email to a nutritionist in which he acknowledged using steroids and requested more, as well as the findings of the blood test. It should be noted, though, that aside from the social media, Liver King already generates $100 million in revenue annually through the sale of protein supplements and dried animal organs through his businesses, Heart and Soil, and Ancestral Supplements. He sells pills containing grass-fed beef liver for $30 to $65 per bottle. That explains what he said in a video that, I'm making this video to apologize because I fucked up, because I'm embarrassed and ashamed, and because I lied and misled a lot of people. Before social media, I was rich and anonymous, and after social media, I'm still rich, but no longer anonymous, and I never expected this kind of exposure in the public eye. It's been tricky as fuck to navigate. Clearly, I did it wrong, and I'm here now to set the record straight. He apologized for deceiving his fans by pretending to be all natural and acknowledged taking 120 milligrams of testosterone weekly. He claimed to have called the YouTube who posted the video that exposed him in a different video. So I called him and said, uh, thank you for doing this. I don't know what good will come out of this, but good, bad, and different, you know everything in life is good, and I'm going to find a way to make silver linings out of this, he said. Johnson attributed his use of steroids to his insecurity, though. When I talk about the 85% of the population that suffers from self-esteem issues, that's me. I'm part of the statistic. This is why I fucking work myself to death in the gym. This is why I do 12 to 15 blood-burning workouts a week just to feel like I'm okay, he said. And hormone replacement has helped in a profound and significant way. 
uncertainty surrounds the future of his enterprise, and Johnston is being silent on his plans. All I can do is take extreme ownership right now, be better, and lead myself to a better life as a better human, he told his followers.